Hey, what's up, guys? So, in this video, we will see how to use remote control app on any Oppo phone. Now, to do that, first of all, just check if your Oppo phone has an IR blaster or not. Now, the IR blaster can be at the top or at the back of your Oppo phone. Now, in our case, the IR blaster is at the back beneath the main camera. Now, if your Oppo phone does not have an IR blaster, then you will not be able to use the remote control app because it is a hardware requirement and without the IR blaster, the remote simply will not work. Now, if your Oppo phone has an IR blaster, then the next step is, is to open the app drawer and from here, just look for an app which is called IR remote. Just tap on it. Now, to set up our remote, just tap on the plus icon over here. Now, from this list, just select the home appliance for which you want to create a remote. For an example, I will select TV. Now from this list, just select the brand of your home appliance for which you are creating a remote. For an example, I will select Samsung, then tap on got it. Now it is asking is your home appliance is currently turned on or off. Now if your home appliance is currently turned on, just select yes. And if it is turned off, just select no. Now the next step is, is to point the IR blaster of your smartphone to the home appliance. Then tap on the power button over here. And once you do that, it will ask you that did your home appliance respond to the button tap or not. If your home appliance did not respond, just tap on no response. And once you do that, it will change the configuration of the signal. Now just tap on this button until your home appliance responds to the button tap. Now once your home appliance responds to the button tap, then select yes. Then tap on this button one more time. And if your home appliance responds again, just select yes. Now just press this button again and check if your home appliance responds or not. For example, if it responds, just select yes. Now from this section, just give a name to your home appliance. For example, if you have a TV at your office and one at your home, you can name the one in your office, Samsung office or Samsung TV office or anything which you want. After that, you will have the option to create a home screen shortcut of this remote. And if you want to create a home screen shortcut for this remote, just enable this toggle. Otherwise, you can disable it. Then tap on save. And once you do that, you will create a remote on your smartphone. And as you can see, the IR blaster is responding by the button press of the remote. Now, if you have deleted the IR remote app by mistake or if your Oppo phone has an IR blaster but does not have an IR remote app, you can download one from the Google Play Store. To do that, just open the Google Play Store. Then in the search bar, just search this. Then install any remote from here. For example, I will install this remote app. Then tap on open. From here, select Agree. Now to create a remote, just tap on Add Remote. And the process is similar as we have done earlier. Now just select the home appliance for which you want to create a remote. And from this list, just select the brand of your home appliance. Now just answer this question. Then point the IR blaster to the device and tap on this button until the home appliance responds. Then select Yes. And from here, just give a name to your remote. Then tap on done. And once you do that, you will create a remote for your home appliance, just like that. And as you can see, the IR blaster is responding by the button press. And this is how you can use a remote control app on any Oppo phone. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.